sausage is thoroughly cooked. Onions are getting a little translucent. I don't want them too bad. I just want them crunchy. I just want to taste that. So now we're going to start adding our other ingredients. What I need to do first is get this off the heat. So whenever you're moving your Dutch ovens around, get your lid on it. Because I guarantee you anything and everything will get in that Dutch oven. doing is placing my extra coals on top of my Dutch oven lid. And with a 12 inch Dutch oven, I am going to want about seven or eight coals on the bottom. No more than that. go. Redistributed. We'll take our lid lifter. Take this off. Add our ingredients. Onions, garlic, and mushrooms. about 15 ounces, pound of hash browns, and our egg mix. First, we get this mixed up really good. About halfway stirred there, I'm gonna start adding some more seasoning. ground black pepper and all this is seasoned to taste. It's entirely up to you how much you want to put on. Garlic salt. Go low sodium, no sodium if you want. Parsley. That's my flavor threesome. My go-to that I always always use. Give this another good mix. My eggs in. That is that. One final mix. Get everything evenly coated, distributed. Like a big old pot of slop. back on there. And I'll be cooking that for about 30 minutes. Okay, it's been about 40 minutes now. I'll take a look at this. I always, with any egg dish, I always like to tip the peak. Make sure it's firmed up. And that is rock solid done. So now what we're going to do is throw on our topping, and that is cheese. 
I just have a couple leftover mixes. Pre-shredded cheese. This is only going to be on here, cooking only long enough to um, melt. And this heat that is not going to take long. Just a medley of cheeses. So I've got some. Colby, some mozzarella, some cheddar, just to get the ooze on the top of that. And that's all there is to that. About five minutes from now, we're going to be eating Mountain Man breakfast. It is done. Breakfast is served.